No, there, there is nothing you can help with. Please leave me alone. You're, you're just gonna... Okay, no, he's actually walking away. But I just thought he was gonna stand there. <laughs> Offense, pal, but I asked you like, well, actually, I asked you three weeks ago in real time, but in game time, I asked you like 20 minutes ago. So, if uh, if you could land at engineering, that would be great. We need to get the ship back up to uh, up to code, so to speak. Now, cheers, cheers, pal. So, did you miss me, Frank? You, uh, yeah. okay, he's not answering. Right, folks, good news, help. Is on hand. I've got an amazing machine who can fix all of this. Get the engines up to snuff, but we've got the generators. Full on total restoration. We can even explore deep space if needed. Should to get on board. Hey, I'll good to see you again. Good to see you too. I've been standing here for the last hour. Where have you been? Well, okay. Bye then. Okay, fine. I'll go meet Frank in engineering. We'll hook the tunnels up to main engineering, which is located in main engineering, and we'll go fix the ship. And now we can all have popcorn. Does anyone want popcorn? I, I might make popcorn. Well, I'm so gonna make popcorn. Okay, Franklin, land when you're ready, pal. Whenever you're ready. Okay, we seriously need to, to tire some stuff. Slaves or something. This room needs a. In fact, no, scratch it. The whole ship needs a bit of a clean. But a Frank up to do it. No, no. I thought I couldn't get out of people to kill them. Oh, well, I'll, I'll get the gloves on. Let's get this sorted. Uh, okay, Frank, I think I've removed shield power to uh, to most of the decks, apart from engineering, so you should be able to land with your shield in. I'm, I'm sorry, you have to speak up. There's a lot of sparks. Okay, I can't answer. Just. What was that about pizza? Well, yeah, we're gonna have pizza, but after we fix engineering. Oh, oh, you beautiful blue bastard. Oh, did you miss me? Did, did, did you miss me? She didn't miss me. I swear to God, if he's touched anything, I'm gonna punch him in his bony, bone-like, boneness. He better not touch anything. Um, also, on a separate note, I'm pretty sure this is a glitch. Just wanna, uh, wanna point out the glitch, breaking the fourth wall. Hashtag, fourth wall glitchness. Hashtag subscribe. Hashtag Fallout 76 YOLO. Hashtag give us an offline mode for a punch in the face of the system. Hashtag much love. Oh, hello, you beautiful creature of doom. Gecko, how have you been, sugar? Still green? Fair enough. Um, where's Frank? Do you mean he's gone to the toilet? How could he possibly. What could he possibly do in the toilet? He has no internal organs. He can't die. Do you know what? I really don't want to know. Actually, I, I kind of do. Um, has, has no one thought to answer the phone while we've begun? No one's thought to answer the phone. It could be... Imp oh, I'll get it later. Okay, that's going to really warm me up. But if I know if I answer it, I know someone's going to want to help. But I really don't have time. Anywho, glad everyone's fine, no matter where is Frank, I'll, I'll find him there. Um, I left something here, I need to go pick it up. I can't believe Frank's not in the console room. I really hope he's not lost the fub watch, because I'll have him stuck as a disgusting, oh, disgusting human. Oh. oh, Frank, what the hell? Why, why, why did you mess with the inter interior design of the, of the corridors? You've got a freaking... Oh. Oh, wait, no, that fixed it. Uh, th thank you, TARDIS. Cheers, sugar. Much love. OK, 
Can I party? Who's a good doggy? Who's the good robot doggy? Oh, you left Apollo nuts and bolts in the corner. For God's sake. Oh, listen, have you seen Frank? He didn't have a watch with him, did he? No? Oh, right, never mind. Yo, Franklin! Buddy! <clears throat> <clears throat> Frank? Seriously, where is Frank in that goddamn watch? Oh, for God's sake. You would have thought he would have tied it up while I was gone. S seriously. F fucking believable. Oh, he's left me a note in crayon. To the courier. I've popped back to Vegas because I got bored of your ugly moustache. And I wanted to see some friends. Hashtag work colleagues. Hashtag slaves. Hashtag people I like to annoy. Also, I may have pressed some buttons and fiddled with some wires. And I may have punched Jimi Hendrix in the face again. For God's sake, Frank. Also, left that stupid watch in your bedroom. P.S. You're a bastard. P.S. I don't like you. P.S. I may have pooped in the kitchen sink. Oh, really? For, for God's sake. Well, at least he left the fob watch here. That's good. Generally surprised he didn't take it with him. Well, I'm guessing you would know kick his ass. Come on, tunnel powers, come back to me. Seriously, this whole being human thing really isn't as fun as it looks. I feel so empty and thick and stupid and ooh. Right, no time like the present. Come on, Frog Watch. I've never actually tried this. So, well, I had that one time I was human, but that was different. I coded it differently. I've never tried it to its full potential. I'm not sure if I coded it properly. This could end in drastic tears. <laughs> Okay, so far so good. And who's your mother? There we go. I'm okay, I'm good. Two hearts, two arms, two noses. No, sorry, one nose. Sorry, I was thinking of my sister. She was she was weird. Sense of smell though. The brain stems, the kidneys, two hearts, ten fingers, ten toes. Okay, we're good, we're back. We're awesome. Happy days. We're time lord. Woohoo! Huh. I need to punch Frank in the face when I see him. Oh, Seriously. with that incessant beeping stop! Seriously winding me up. Okay, Gecko. I'm pretty sure I've got the external wiring system hooked up properly, so we should be, we should be attached to main engineering of the ship. I'm, I'm not too sure though, all the buttons read no connection. Oh, wait, no, sorry, I didn't turn on the power relays. Okay, yeah, there's a connection now, we're good. We're, we're, we're good. If you could answer the damn phone though, Gecko, seriously, this is getting ridiculous. It won't stop beeping, it's winding me up. Just tell them they've got the wrong number. Or just sit there all politely and completely ignore me. That that works too. Thank you for your help, Gecko. You are a fantastic companion, a fine, fine lizard creature, and a great friend for doing sweet FA. Listen, just stay in here and ignore the phone, clearly. I'm gonna go press some things on the bridge and hopefully extend the power relays to the ship. And then we can get things fixed. Sound like a plan? Okay, it's a plan. Good news, everyone. We have, like, literally unlimited power now so we can fix literally everything. And they've got an amazing space adventure. P.S. I'm driving, by the way. No one else getting ideas, Uncle Dips. Why? All I need to do is pound the relays from this end. And then we can get things... Oh, what was that? Oh, no. You are not telling me there's a problem with the ship and we're going to crash. Nope, nope, nope. We have done that plot literally for years. Can we not think of anything else? Next you will tell me the lights are going to flicker and it's going to stop. Oh, for Christ's sake. Do we get all our plot points from the same person? I mean, can we not think of anything new? For once, it'd be nice if we just did something that didn't bother with a ship crash. Just for once. Can we not just have a day with rainbows or something? Listen, I've kind of done this before, so just hold on to something. We should be fine.
No way, yeah. No. Let's crash that. We're not the TARDIS. Everyone, pray to something or someone. We are going to crash. Uh, Sally, sugar, I need you to press buttons. I don't know why, but just press buttons. I think in, I think, I think in doing do something, I've, I've lost what we can speak. Sally, you there, buddy? Sally, are you even listening to me? Why is it when I ever press anything, things just break? Why? Because for what? Something just not work when I press it. For what? Please, just let things work. Okay, I think you know what the problem was. I think in powering the TARDIS up to the main ship system stuff with the core and everything, I think I tripped a couple of systems on the ship, causing the power to fuse, for lack of a better term. I'm just gonna Jedi my hand all over here. As you do, press buttons, and that literally did nothing. That legit didn't work. Okay, yeah, no, folks, we're legitimately going to crash now. Now it's a fantastic time to poop your pants. Can I poop my pants at least? Oh, there must be an emergency boot up sequence to turn the thing back on. What if I just turn the thing to ship off? It's not that difficult. Next, you tell me the thrusters have gone offline. I literally hate being right. It's genuinely a piece of shit. Okay, okay. No problem, we're fine, we're good, we're good, it's peaches, fin. I mean, yeah, we're falling out of orbit at a very alarming rate, and we're going to crash down in the middle of the planet, and probably blow up and blow up half the planet, but yeah, no, yeah, it's fine, it's cool, it's cool. <laughs> Panic, I'm not panicking, Sally, it's all good. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to break down. This is your attempt for a hug. Do you want to have a look at the systems? Do you know how to work it? Yeah, because I didn't try that already. Okay, you are literally no help, but thanks anyway. Oh, we're gonna crash. Oh god, we're gonna crash. Um, I don't know what to do. The TARDIS usually does all this stuff for me. Uh, Sally, give me a hug. Or just piss off that works too, thanks. Okay, everyone just pretend we're not crashing, that might work. Okay, this screen has a bunch of flashing lights. I'm not too sure what they do. Sally. How do you feel about getting out and pushing? I'll take that as a maybe. I'll take that as a maybe. Okay, we've got no power. Backup power's offline. The engines are offline. And we're falling at an alarming rate. Has anyone got any kind of plan? I'm really up for suggestions. Walk stairs like an absolute idiot. Seriously. How does he how did he survive for so long without me? I really don't know. Oh crap, I'm picking up speed. Um okay, I've got nothing. This, this is that's this is it. Uh, I've got brace for impacts. Wait, why don't I just use the tires to get one out? Okay, I've opened all the air vent and thermo vents to the main engineering. Hopefully, the re-entry heat should fire up the, the batteries. Or make enough wind to turn things and create power. I think that's what I've done. Or I've just controlled the light switches. I'm, I'm not too sure. Th this, could end, this could end drastically. But hopefully, with this ends well. The thing, fingers crossed this ends well. Buddy, what I need you to do is I need you to, you know, sit down because you could break things like your face, which I, I don't want to fix. That takes too long to find me asked. And I need you to, to operate the landing gear. The ship has it, don't worry. It's just designed to land on a planet. It's really not that happy. They use a special light ray material. Never mind. Uh, just put the landing gear down. Big guy, I need you to. You should understand me now with the TARDIS back in my head. You should understand every word I'm saying. Nice to meet you, by the way. I'm the courier. Um, I was the guy who took over the ship. And uh, you helped a lot, a bunch of great asses for that one. If you could just do something to help us land. Like, my phone vibrating on the land. Because that would really help. Sally, you're the ship better than anyone. You could just stay still for a second, that would be really helpful. Sally, activate the aviation controls. I need to extend all drags and, and drop fins and, and air brakes and everything. You were just at the control, and now you're moving. Why are you moving from the controls I need you to be at? You, you don't understand. We're gonna crash. Yeah, no, just stare at the Chinese dude. Wait, is that racist? That wasn't meant to be racist. Please work, 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 
please look, please look, please look. Gecko? How, how did you get the comms to work? Listen, how's the TARDIS doing? She's sitting there enjoying the view. Of course she is, because helping me is so much hard work. Oh, if Tomos had a god to pray to, this would be a great time to pray. Ah, come on, don't crash, please don't crash. Okay, we're on the atmosphere. <laughs> and guess we're going to crash land. Okay, everyone, this is it, folks. Um, we've, do, we, do we forget anything? Is there anything else we can do? Is there any other way to... Okay, no, fine. Just, just everyone just sit still. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ugh. Woo! Son of a bitch. We did it. We, we, we didn't crash. <laughs> we did it. We did... What, what, what was that, Gecko? Well, folks, good news. We didn't crash, but the TARDIS managed to even though she wasn't moving or doing anything, the fluid leaks exploded. Meaning there's mercury leaks all over the ship. Mercury vapor, to be precise. Oh, that ship just hates me with a passion. Oh, okay, well, let's, let's get out for a second and see what the damage is. Huh. Actually, all things considered, not a bad landing. Well, apart from the screaming and peeing my pants, but yeah, no. Pretty peachy. Just um, kind of wish I put it somewhere no one's going to notice. This could end in tears. Unless you're an absolute genius, gorgeous redhead like me. <clears throat> I said, well, never mind. I'll see you in a minute. Seriously, though, guys, I, I have a plan. I don't have a plan. Okay. This. Bollocks. Come on, switch. Oh, wait, no, that was a wire. Eh, the last switches. Oh, thank you so very much for your long-term help. I really appreciate you just sitting on your green ass. Now, just move that telepathic crystal over there. Plug in the Zeton crystals. Remove those crystals. I think this entire thing is made of crystals. And voila. Awesome. Go me. Yeah. Oh, crap. Oh, I'm floating. Oh, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Graphical issue, folks. Uh, grab it. Oh, you know, Gecko, if you could be more helpful, I'd be appreciative. Well, right, Gecko, good news. I've extended the perception filter around the entire ship so no one can see us. They'll just sort of ignore us. It takes way too long to explain. Listen, basically, it sort of makes you not want to look. You know it's there, but you don't really care. As such, we blend in perfectly. Just the TARDIS is drawing a lot of power from so we can't fly for a while. Well, until I get the ship back in orbit. I might have to start working on that, actually. And have you not answered the phone yet? Well, I'm going to take the ringing as a no. Okay, cool, good job. Awesome. Real, real fun. Real great. 